Hello and welcome to my channel. In this video segment, I'm going to show you how to change your transmission fluid in your 2018 Ford Transit. This won't take long and just follow this video step by step and you will have your vehicle back on the road again. If you're not a subscriber, hit that button, become a subscriber right away. So let's begin. We're going to go underneath the vehicle. And on your right side of your transmission, that's where you will find your dipstick, your filler plug, and your drain plug, all in one. And we need a 19 millimeter. This plug may be a little tight. And especially if it had never been off before, chances are it will be. May have to double wrench. There we go. Maybe we can get it off with our fingers. Just screw it right on up. Move my hand out the way so you can actually see it. You pull it up. Now, you want to pull the cap off and leave the dipstick in there. You don't want to pull them both off at the same time. You don't want to take a chance of breaking off the dipstick. And we're going to pull the dipstick out. This is what the dipstick looks like. I like to see where the, the fluid level is on the dipstick before I actually suck it out of the uh, transmission. Gives me a general idea as to how the vehicle was running. And this is where it should be, according to the dipstick, and that's where we're gonna put it when we fill it back up. And this is what I'm gonna use. This tool really helps me. I'm gonna use it along with a jug to actually catch the fluid, because I actually wanna see what the fluid looks like. And here's the part number. I got it from my local auto parts store. It didn't cost much, you can see the price range. And there are so many different ways to use this, but it comes with uh, several, several hoses. But I'm gonna use these two hoses here, and I'm gonna suck out with one hose and pump with the other hose. What we're gonna do, we're gonna put this hose far down as possible inside the pan. Just put it down as far as we can. That should do. I can feel it laying on the bottom of the pan. We just wanna suck it out. And you might have to move the hose around some just to get a good suction. Just wanna move it around a little bit more. There we go. Got a good flow. Hope you can see that. Let me move that around. There you go. Got a good steady flow. Wow, look at that. I think that needed to be changed. While the fluid is draining, I want to take it to the service manual. Now, when you look here on this page, it says change automatic transmission fluid and filter. 150,000 miles. Every 150,000 miles. I prefer to do it at 100,000 miles or once a year. Whichever comes first. When it stops flowing out, just go ahead and just move your hose around and start pumping on your pump again. And just make sure you got everything out of it that you can possibly get out. Now what I'm going to do, instead of pumping out of the, the transmission pan, I want to pump out of the, the cord, transmission cords, and just pump right into the transmission. Just put our tube up here, right in the filler hole. Other end in the transmission cord, and we just want to pump, pump fluid into the transmission. Mm -hmm. 
It do not take long to suck it out. After about six or eight pumps, she's empty. All right, I have put in two and a half quarts. And that's where we want to be. So it took two and a half quarts for me. Just going to put the dipstick back in. And I'm going to put the cap back on. Screw it back down. Has a seal on the end of it. Just tighten it up. Put our 19 millimeter wrench on it. Tighten it back down. And that should do it. What I'm gonna do next, I'm gonna run the vehicle, I'm gonna run around the block, and then I'm gonna do the same thing again because you see how dark the transmission fluid was. And I know what the manual says, 150,000 miles. Ladies and gentlemen, it would not hurt to actually change it before 850,000 miles. I, it wouldn't hurt to change it at 90,000 miles, 80,000 miles. I hope this video was helpful. Do not forget to subscribe, take care, and do not forget to hit the notification bell to let you know when I have a video to come out. And God bless.